In February 2022, Green Music Australia provided six Victorian music businesses with the opportunity to take part in the Green Action Program, an eight-week subsidised training course for the music industry to help them understand, monitor and improve their environmental impact. We have uh, commercial kitchens, we have downstairs in the basement, we have cellars which have glycol machines and post-mix machines and generators, so you're drawing a lot of energy all of the time. The environmental impact of what we do is huge, and we know, we know that. I think the music industry has an incredible voice and an incredible profile, and we're able to raise awareness and affect change on, on many issues, but I think we've got a fundamental issue that we probably don't know enough about how we operate. We don't know uh, the environmental impact of that. And, and, and so the program for me is, is about starting to build that baseline knowledge in our industry. We designed the program to incorporate climate science and First Nations voices. This helped businesses build a coherent map to set goals, targets, and work towards practical outcomes. With our help, businesses have been collecting baseline data for things like travel, waste, and energy and then we'll provide them with annual reports so they can meet their sustainability goals. It's made us look at every area of the business in a lot more depth and really see how we can embed our sustainability practices into everything we do. I'm a numbers guy. I, I need to know how to like measure that improvement and, and push myself to drive myself for improvement and understanding where the outputs are was like, I actually now know that information. We also run a walkthrough energy audit at venues to give folks first-hand experience on how to cut their electricity consumption. So a really simple thing was having a regular check of your fridge seals or installing sensor lights into low traffic areas. Pre-order dinner and show meals. We've cut down on 15% waste just by going through our ticket provider with mosh ticks to the ticket holder and going, hey guys, these are the orders, what would you like? And we've also gone to um, wine, would you believe, on the tap. That cuts down over the course of 52 weeks, 16,640 bottles of wine. We've never measured this data before for Music Victoria Awards, and then every year we'll be able to improve on that. It, it can't just be a, like, a green movement, it's got to be an everyone movement.